A severe winter storm this morning threatens the eastern edge of New England. The New Jersey shore got up to a half a foot of snow overnight. Cape Cod, down east Maine, and parts of Canada are under a blizzard threat. Michelle Miller is in Chatham, Massachusetts, right on the elbow of Cape Cod. Good morning. Sustained winds have been churning up the surf, producing dangerous swells in near whiteout conditions, with forecasts of hurricane force winds throughout the day. Just before 4 a.m., snow started to whip through the Cape as wind gusts reached nearly 30 miles an hour. It's all part of a weather pattern that has been making its way up the eastern seaboard. On Tuesday, flurries coated parts of North Carolina, Virginia, and Pennsylvania before the storm made its way up to Massachusetts early Wednesday. It's just the latest round in a brutal winter, and Cape Cod locals are hoping it is the last. Just one more, that's it. John Jaworski is the manager at True Value in Chatham, where they nearly ran out of shovels. We thought it was over, so, you know. With upwards of eight inches expected on some parts of the Cape, customers are still straggling in, picking up the last of the shovels and salt, steering clear of fertilizer and seed as we near April, the start of Jaworski's most profitable season. If it was January or February, yeah, it'd be great for business, but um, not the end of March. Kind of ready for spring and summer. Local officials are bracing themselves for scattered power outages throughout the area. They're warning motorists to stay off the roads, mariners to stay off the water. The snow should end by this afternoon, but the wind gusts are expected to last throughout the evening. Clarissa, Charlie. Michelle, thank you.